Quick order of business. At this time, I'd like to introduce a man who, of course, reigned victorious as the president of the Hollywood Press Club last year. Um, I'm very happy to communicate that he's also just won last week's election and will be occupying the Prexy throne for another term. Tomorrow, he's off to visit the other president, Ronald Reagan, and after the annual presidential inaugural ball, he'll be holding several press conferences in Washington. Uh, apparently, the members of this organization are not the only ones who recognize and appreciate Dwight Blackshear's prodigious commitment to the Hollywood working press. He's a wonderful man, and of course, on a broader scope, the industry that we're in and he so loyally serves so well. Representing Tom Bradley this evening in a mayoral capacity is Miss Wanda Moore. Wanda, you'll come up here, please. on behalf of Mayor Tom Bradley. Unfortunately for him, he could not be here. Fortunately for me, this has been a wonderful, wonderful evening and an experience. And we appreciate and we like to thank the Hollywood Press and Entertainment Industry Club for allowing us to participate in such a very, very special night. On behalf of Tom Bradley, the mayor of the city of Los Angeles, we would like to present a commendation to Dwight Blackshear, who is the president, and as we well know, president of the Hollywood Press and Entertainment Industry Club. Tonight, celebrating their annual Life Achievement Awards dinner, January 17, 1986. We're not going to read all of the whereases here. We would just like to share with you that Dwight's outstanding leadership, drive, and commitment, restructuring the organization, making its membership international, revamping its marketing strategy, that the Hollywood Press and Entertainment Industry Club is ascending to new heights at a tremendous rate, and that this young man, who is such a phenomenon, such a dynamic personality, who has done such an outstanding job that its membership this audience, the board of directors, have made the decision that he should come back and reign once again as president of their organization. Dwight Blackshear, sir, if you would please come and allow us to make this presentation to you on behalf of Mayor Tom Bradley, we would indeed be grateful, sir. President, congratulations. We look forward to another outstanding and very exciting year. And to all of the great talents in this room tonight, on behalf of the city of Los Angeles, thank God for you. Thank God for your being out there and allowing us when we have down days to be entertained and you bring us up for giving us faith and for hope, for being there, for making each day a little bit easier. Mr. Blackshear, thank you, sir. Thank you very much. That's wonderful. Thank you, Wanda. Wanda Moore of the Mayor's Office. Mayor Bradley. Uh, before our fearless leader joins us uh, again on stage, I'd like to first introduce Senator Diane Watson. Senator Watson, come up here, please. that we have the opportunity of being in the room with everyone we've ever seen and loved. And that's the way I feel this evening. Mr. Forsythe, how many evenings have I swooned over you? <laughs> Only the five. 
find that you're better looking in person, and I thought you were great looking on the screen. And then my dear love, Sammy, we're so glad to see you out and among them, and I expect to see you dancing on this stage next time I'm here. And then there's Richard. And uh, you know, when I look at him, I start laughing. <laughs> he, and he's very serious. And I just laugh because that's what he engenders in me. And then I want to talk about my dear friend Donna Brown, and she's very quiet this evening. But Donna, and I'm going to tell something about myself, was my fifth grade student on Okinawa. <laughs> and she married someone that you all know. We call him Benson, but his name is Robert Guillaume. And I performed the service. So, <laughs> stand up, Donna. Now, Donna was two and I was ten. <laughs> Child prodigy. But Dwight, I want to say thanks to you for recognizing what Hollywood is all about. The entertainment industry and those who make it work and bringing such great notables here as the people I've named to Mr. Roach. I am honored to be in the same room with him. I'm a kid that grew up in the theater and I remember your name flashing across that screen. Linda Evans, I've admired that look of yours for the longest time. <laughs> but thank you, Dwight, for making it all possible. And I come here representing the people that I work with in Sacramento. There are 120 of us and they represent all of you. I come from the California State Senate, and we want to let you know that we recognize what you have done. We honor you this evening, and we say to the whole industry that you're lucky to have him, and he is lucky to be here to bring all of you together. So the people of the state wanted me to bring to you and to say to you and the industry, thank you for making our lives a little happier and a little brighter. Would you come up and join me, Dwight, please? That's hell to the chief, that's pretty great. <laughs> and we do say hell to the chief. Dwight Blackshear, the people of California say thank you. They recognize your achievement. And this resolution comes not only from me, but our president pro tem. Thank you and congratulations. Dwight, if you'll just stay up here for a moment. Thank you very much, Senator. Diane Watson. First, let me lift...